Hello everybody and welcome to this let's play of Emma's story with yours truly Slow Wolf. This is part one uh, in this story. I don't know how many parts there are. I th there might be a part two right now. But either way, this is part one as far as I know. Let's find out what it's all about. Emma's story by Neil Winkler. You are Emma, daughter of esteemed scientist Dr. Robert Coleman. Ever since his discovery of the mythical orb of power, he has vanished. And by he has, I mean he has, bleh. Leaving you alone in the family estate. With strange things happening, you wonder what has happened to him. The story begins as you wake up in your room to find an ominous note from your lover. As you play, you will unravel Emma's story. Let's get started. <laughs> Creepy upside down baby face. Either way, I'm kind of excited. I finally got the custom story mods to work. I tried to get Disponentia to work, but I couldn't um, find out how to get it to work. So maybe next time. But ooh. Hello. Big room. Nice big room. It's in here. Ooh. Uh -huh. Yeah. Ah, nothing. Word. Nice desk. Oh, nope. Not lots of lights too. That's a nice start. Oh, it's a tender box. Hello, tender box. Hello. Look, get out of the way, chair. Letter from Neil. Dearest Emma, I don't know how this note will ever find you, but I am in trouble. I'm currently in captivity. Placed here, I dare to say it, by your father. He's always been a bit off, but this time he most certainly has gone insane. I've never seen him like this before. I believe it to be related to that object, the, the orb of power that he found while on his latest trip out of the country. It has somehow changed him. I know he keeps it in a secret room in his lab. At all costs, you must locate this orb and destroy it. Only then should your father return to normal. Please be careful, but make haste! Remember, find the lab and destroy that orb. Your lover, Neil. That's not creepy at all. Well, I'm gonna go ahead and be a proper lady and put my things back where they belong. Mm -hmm. Like that. Or get in there. Good cheer. Oh, what's over here? <gasps> you! Flee from this accursed place! I still think that they're friends of mine that I should save. Oh, there we go. Tinderbox! Hello, Tinderbox. Uh, oil? That's great. Uh, do I have a lantern yet? No. No. Uh, no lantern yet. That's fine. Ah. Uh -huh. Uh -huh. Nope, nothing in there. <gasps> it's a chest! It's a big chest. Oh, screw you. I'm not a proper lady anymore. Oh, hey -oh. It's a book! I throw the book in the fire. I am no liking a book. Oh, what's in here? Anything under the piano lid? Nope. Anything on the bookshelf? Just books. You shouldn't lay your books like that. You should lay them all over the floor! Okay. Get this door then. Oh. Hello, big, big, open, spacious, empty area. You're not creepy in the least. Also, cool helmet thingies. Like, very neat. Moving onward. Let's explore this hallway. Uh, broken picture. That's weird. Haven't I been taking care of this place? I should explore this floor first before leaving. Okay. That's right. <clears throat> oh, I should explore this floor first before leaving. That's going to be my new lady voice. There must be a key around here somewhere. To the journal, what do you say? Notes. Letter from Neil. Mementos. I must find the key for this door. No shit, Sherlock! Let's do this. Do, 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 do. Cool paintings again. Jesus Christ, there's a lot to this floor. Oh, storage room is locked. I will need a key. Nothing there. Nothing there. Be free! Oh, another note. Hey, come back here. I require your services. Oh. There we go. I know how to pick things up, I swear. Oh, you're useless to me. Hmm, I need something to find. I find something to break that with. Ooh, chair. Hello, chair. <laughs> and uh, thank you, chair. Certificate of award. 15th of May, 1823. 
This letter is to congratulate Dr. Robert Coleman on his invention of Laudanum. Hey, thank you, Robert Coleman. You saved my ass in the last Amnesia game I played. Your invention heals all ailments and feels so good when used. For this, we award you with a certificate. Congratulations, keep up the good work, and stay high. Signed, Neville Worthington. Worthington. Such a good name. What's in here? Oh. God damn it, there's a hammer! Ugh, creepy. What's in here? Oh. Hello, room. Of darkness. Uh. Things are broken all over the place in here. Uh, you're not a lantern. You're a bottle. Uh -huh. That did nothing. Okay, well, let's explore. Uh -huh, uh -huh. Nothing, nothing. Oh, tinderbox, hello. Uh, it's a fireplace. Is there anything inside the fireplace? Nope. You deceived me. Okay, what's in here? Maps. Nothing of use. It's been torn apart. Holy and systematically torn apart at that. Alright, uh, there we go. So is there anything of worth in here? Probably inside the drawers. Oh, hello. Notice of key creation. 10th of November, 1825. To Dr. Coleman. Hello, Robert. I had that key to that metal door on the second floor created today. It should arrive within the week. Probably longer, knowing our parcel service. Do be careful in that room now. We don't want any more incidents like what happened to that butler last month, do we? <laughs> I could still hear that awful scream sometimes in my nightmares. Anyway, I hope all is well with you. Your friend, Braxton Archer. That's a pretty badass name, no word of a lie. I did not like that tone. At all. It's a key. <gasps> what? Oh, find a dark corner. Oh, 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 oh. What the fuck is going on? Okay, that's just an unsettling event. The door shut on me, that's fine. No worries. See? Emma? No problem. That was creepy, though. No, that goes to other floors. I didn't try out all the doors, though. Oh, it's another room. This one contains a wardrobe for ease of running away. Good to know. Okay. Nothing in here, nothing in here, nothing in here. And by running away, I mean, you know, tactical treat. I never run. Huh. Not ever. Uh, uh. Oh, hello. Oh, another key. Interesting. Come on. There you are. Emergency supplies. 20th of April, 1822. I have stashed an extra supply of tinder boxes and a lantern inside the storage closet adjacent to this room in a case of emergencies. If it is locked, which it should be, use this key to gain entry. Well, well, well. Ain't that just handy dandy. Oh, birds. I hear birds. Outside my window. Oh, look at that. Oh, oh I can't even see the ground, and this is the second floor. What the fuck? Like, it's the second floor! Why the fuck can't I see the floor? Like, I can't see the ground? Am I uh, perched high on a hill or something? Uh-huh. Alright, fine. So, uh, there's the mail key. Storage room key. Bingo! Uh, ooh, creepy. Lantern, hello. Ah, thank you. What's in here? Ooh, tinderboxes. Three of them. Excellent. Mirror to run. What's in here? Brooms. A carpet. Get out of here. Mm -hmm. Okay, well, the storage room seems to have little else of which I'm concerned with, other than wine and lots of it, but I don't feel like getting drunk tonight, so that's enough of that silliness. Alright. Let's find out what else we have to do on this floor. Do, 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 running down the gigantic hallway. Okay, so I have a feeling that this is exactly where the metal key goes. Ooh, not ominous or creepy at all. Oh, there's a wardrobe. I'm gonna go ahead and open that up just in case, thank you. Anything in it? Oh, oh my fuck! What? 
What the ever-loving fuck was that? Yeah, I want to get out of here, like, right about now. Why is it locked? No, fuck you guys. Get, get, shoot! Why is this locked? I don't like this being locked. Is there anything in here I should be... What the hell? Uh, I don't like this. Turn on the fireplace, turn on the fireplace. Thank you. Oh! Oh no! Oh my god, no! No, 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 no! Oh my fuck! Ah! Oh. 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 That was not cool, game! Fuck you! Fuck you and the gigantic horse you rode in on! I hate you so much! I don't like. Mannequins! Oh, oh. oh my god, fuck you. Why would you have a suit of armor in a closet anyway? Oh, oh, oh. oh screw that. Well, at least I've got a hammer. <laughs> oh my god. Ugh. Okay, I'm good. I'm fine. Okay, I can go to the main hall now. That's always good. Whoa. What the hecky heck? Somehow I knew that cursed orb would come back to haunt me. Why didn't he ever try to warn me, or at least prepare me for this? Interesting way to show a journal. Oh, that wasn't cool. Also, the giggling laughter was a little bit of off off-putting. Clock ticking. Fuck that bullshit. Box, hello. Oh, moving onward. Let's have a place of light for ourselves. A door I can open? Okay. A corner with nothing in it. Some light. A note. Date missing. It's a note fragment. Can't believe he's dead. I'm gonna miss him playing on that piano at dinner time. It just won't be the same. However, I must admit, as a nice fellow as he seemed, I could not help but sense some deep anger or hatred within him against this house. Although I pray he finds peace in the afterlife, I get the feeling... The rest is intelligible. Okay. Not creepy at all. Oil, thank you. Tinderbox, thank you. What? Oh, no. Every time that piano plays, it's a bad fucking day. Oh, I don't want to go anywhere. All right, well, let's go through the door. Let's be brave. Because <sighs> I am brave. Door time. Oh, okay, it's stuck shut. Cool, never mind. No need for door time. I heard a thump. Eh, whatever. It's just a thump. Uh, or more like, Poof. that's how you sound like house. Stupid house. Tick tock, tick tock. Douche. Ugh. Oh, that's what I need the hammer for, probably. Okay, well, what's this way? A very dark room. This builds well. Oh, uh, let's light this up. Thank you. Seems to be locked from the other side. Okay. Oh, not more of you, sons of bitches. Fuck off. I've seen your kind. Oh, like, goodness gracious me. Shut you, because fuck you, that's why. Ugh. Hookah, some wine, some stuff over here. Ooh, hello. Oh, no. At least, is it a hookah? I don't even know. What is this thing? Or is it a decanter? Nope, I'm wrong on all counts. It's a teapot. Obviously. Oop. Screw you, flower pot. Uh-huh. Uh, just a light room, I guess. I don't see anything out of the ordinary. Yeah, you just stay right the fuck there, bitch. It won't budge. Okay. Anything behind this door? Oh, shit, there's blood. Locked, but I can faintly hear breathing sounds on the other side. Oh, fuck that bullshit. Okay, so I got a memento. 
My father's study is locked. I need to find another way in. That's fine. I suppose I can't take it out with a hammer and that this is the exit. The doors are sealed shut. That's not ominous. Locked. The key has to be around here somewhere. All right. Father blocked this off a long time ago. I wonder what he was trying to hide down there. Well, well, well. Why don't we find out? Oh, what? Oh. Stupid boards in the way. Grumble, grumble. I wonder how would one get rid of the boards? I tried to use a hammer on them, it didn't work. Hmm. Alright. Maybe I didn't explore everything in the earlier floor. I don't know. I think I got like another minute to check out. The door seems to be blocked by something. Guess I should keep moving forward. Moving forward. It's a good. Uh, it's a good idea. Okay. Well, there's got to be a key somewhere. You're locked, so you got to be over this way. And I think for this episode, I'm going to count us all out of time. Thank you guys for watching. I hope you guys are enjoying yourselves. I know I sure am. Even though I creeped the fuck out. That one, Oh my god. Either way, I hope you guys are enjoying yourselves. I know I sure am. And I'll see you guys in the next one. Later.